Welcome to Shady and Why. Today we have a thread up unboxing. I'm Marilyn, my husband's Barry, and we are part time resellers. Today we're going to do an unboxing with thread up. If you aren't familiar with thread up, it's an online consignment store, shop, whatever you want to call it. This is, I believe, um, a name brand handbags. I haven't done a name brand handbags in forever, but I saw this one come up and I'm like, ah, I'm not getting any jewelry, so let's um, try this. It was a couple weeks ago. Um, so let's just dive right in and see what we have. Um, if you haven't been here before, we're part-time resellers. Um, we sell on eBay, Etsy, and Poshmark. Um, the information is below. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you so much for joining us. Let's just dive right in. Um, did I say this one was from um, Phoenix, Arizona? Um, we don't get a lot from Phoenix. Um, so let's see how it is. It's a big, tall box. That's what it looks like. So let's just dive right in. Yikes. Uh, maybe this is coach. Maybe it's a coach. I'm not sure. But we have a coach. Uh, I don't see um, a receipt. Um, so I don't really 100% know. But this is so adorable. I love this. This is straw with, um, I know I saw, saw coach, but here's the coach tag. Uh, there's two tags. I'm trying to see, oh, here's a coach right here on the handle. Um, it has braided leather handles that are incredible. It has lacing on the back and it has lacing on the handles. So it has the straw with, I believe that's a deep brown. Um, it comes with a dust bag. That is rare for me. I don't know about anybody else, but it, it's been a while since I had a dust bag. Um, this one does have a creed. It's not bad, it just needs to be wiped down. Um, it has the Coach Glue um, Signature C's on the inside, but that's not bad. It's just a little dusty in the bottom. There might be one, yeah, there's a little stain in the very bottom. One um, zipper pocket on one side is all it has, and it does have the um, key little loop. But this is beautiful, actually. Very beachy. For here in Florida, beachy's good. So the bottom is in excellent condition. There's a little scuff right here. On the bottom, it says coach. Oh, take that all back. <sighs> the straw is split right here on the bottom. So I personally don't know any straw weavers. But, um, so this might be a personal collection bag. So, but, ah, uh, it's so adorable. What a shame. Okay, let's, oh, everybody gets these. Rebecca Minkoff, this is the first time I've gotten the triple, um, um, zippers and this is a bigger one that I'm used to. It's also in brown. Rebecca Minkoff with the only has one tassel. I have a tassel on each zip. Um, the handle looks good. Let's see. It has some schmutz. It needs to be wiped down has some wear on this corner. Ugh, so loud. It has some scuffing here. Ugh. 
is dirty around the edges. Ugh, that noise. And I think that's why I stopped ordering these. Um, it's pretty dirty on the inside, needs to be wiped down. Has two pockets on one side, a zip pocket on the other with a slide pocket. So there you go. Is this brown or black? I think it's black. And the straw one I think is black too. So there's two. I think it's strange whenever they have coach um, handbags and they put a coach in a name brand. Um, but I'm not the only one it happens to. Um, if I haven't said so before, um, the handbags come with four handbags and one accessory. Our accessory is a Kate Spade wallet in a tan taupe color. It's a zipper. Um, really good condition. Just needs to be wiped down. Um, has some a um, little bit of schmutz on it. Has one, two, three, six slots, a slide pocket for your uh, dollars, another area, a zip pocket, a center pocket, and more cards. Um, so that's a really nice. This is a good one. Kate Spade does well. Two more guys. Keep your fingers crossed for something really, really good. This is really, really big, but I don't know about good. Let's see. A brand I have never gotten before. All Saints Company. India. It is a black, big slouch bag. Um, it has um, some wear on the handle. It's tied here, so hopefully, let's see, let's check it out, be sure there's nothing under there that it's hiding. Um, there is some stitches loose on the handle, but it's not torn or anything, just needs some cleaning up, edge coating, it looks like it needs some help. It is um, adjustable, so you can make it into a um, crossbody. Um, it has a zipper on the back. It's very large, um, black inside, with a lot of cleaning, just a lot of, needs to be vacuumed. Um, it has a magnetic closure. Um, I haven't done this in a while. It's like, I'm, I think I'm out of practice. Like, I'm fighting this bag. It's black on the inside with one zipper pocket. Zipper works. But it's big. Guys, I am fighting this purse. <laughs> the zipper in the back does work. It's large. Has a zipper on the front. Has two zipper pockets below that. And then another zipper pocket on the zipper pocket. And they seem to all work. The um, tassels look worn. Maybe it's supposed to be worn. I'm not sure because it's a very, very soft bag. Um, it needs to be conditioned crazy. Um, all the edge coating. This is just really rough, so maybe Everywhere looks rough where there, there's an edge. So it is supposed to be that way. I'm gonna have to look it up, do some research because I'm not sure. It needs to be conditioned. So all saints. And our last bag. Okay. Uh, let's see. Our last bag is a heavy bag, and it's a Dooney and Berg. Look at that, that is beautiful. It's like a soft, pale blue. And um, has a key holder. 
It says Dooney and Fur. It's a red, um, like tweed inside. Uh, let's look for the label. There's a label. It says Dooney and Burr. It has the um, serial number. Can't read where it was made. But um, it's like a bucket, kind of. It's, um, it says Duty and Berg here. It has a little buckle here on each side. Um, it needs to be conditioned as all these do. It does have two handles and this hardware is seen. It um, is gold wash with a little um, like loop flowers kind of. I don't know if you can see those, but they are beautiful. This bag, um, conditioned and cleaned, is going to be a stunner. Um, very, very pretty. On the inside, it does have one zipper pocket on one side and a tiny little pocket on the other. So very, very small. Um, maybe for your keys. Um, but it does have like the key holder also, um, but that's beautiful. So that's what we have. We have a Dooney and Burr, a All Saints, a Kate Spade wallet, the must have Rebecca Minkoff, and a adorable straw coach, um, just with the edges and a split in um, from there to there in the straw. Um, but this is probably the cutest bag. Um, adorable. And don't forget, dust cover. So this is like an extra item because I won't keep it for this one. So there you go. That is our name brand handbags. Hope you enjoyed it today. Sorry, I felt like I was really out of practice doing the handbags. I've been doing jewelry so much. It's like fighting them. I'm like wrestling the purses. So hopefully you have enjoyed this wrestling match between me and the name brand handbags. Be sure if you haven't already to subscribe below, give us a thumbs up. And I will see you on the next one. But don't forget, thank you for spending a little bit of your day with us. And see you on the next one. Bye.